Okay, some of you guys have requested that I test the Undead DLC for Red Dead Redemption on the Radiant R4. And my settings are set to... My settings are set to... 720p? Uh, yeah, my settings are set to 720p on the lowest settings. The absolute lowest settings on 720p. And the game seems to run somewhat, somewhat better than the story mode. On the story mode, we're getting about 16 to 21 frames per second. And on this Undead Nightmares DLC, we're getting about 18 to 22 frames per second. So yeah, let's, uh, let's try a lower resolution and see what happens. Let's try 800 by... Let's try 800 by 600. Uh, 800 by 600, apply. Let's see what the FPS is like. Let's see how it runs. Hmm. Okay, seems to run a little bit better, dude. Now we're running about uh, 20, 21, 24 frames per second, 25 frames per second. And it seems pretty consistent for now. <laughs> it seems pretty consistent for now. Let's run around and see uh, if it drops below 20. And uh, oh yeah, we're, we're dropping below 20. But still pretty good, you know? Overall, it still runs a little bit better than the story mode. So, yeah. You son of a bitch! After all we did for you! Alright, let's uh... Let's go back to 720p. What is going hey, you guys can rotate uh, between uh... 800 by 600 and 720p. For me, I like 720p because it's uh, it's full screen. I can see everything a little bit better. But yeah, you guys can choose if you want to play on 80. You guys can choose if you want to play this Undead Nightmares DLC on 800 by 600 or 720p. For me, I'll choose 720p <laughs> because I can see everything better. You know. I'll see if I can give you guys an 8 minute video of how this runs, you know? So you guys can see that this performance is pretty consistent. And this is what you get playing on the Radiant R4, so yeah. Not the worst and it's not the best. <laughs> it's it's pretty much like the bare minimum you need to play this game. <laughs> Runs nicely. Look look at that. Red Dead Redemption 1 PC port. Runs okay. Oh wow. Now we're going down in the town area. The framework is dropping a little bit. 
but it should go back to about a constant like 15 18 frames in a second once we pass this cutscene once we get past this cutscene we should be running about 15 to 18 frames in the city in this little town area and yeah still playable we're dropping down to about 14 and it's because we're in this little town area but still playable Fifteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. We get twenty, twenty. So yeah, this is what you get playing on the Radiant R four with the Undead DLC. And yeah, if you guys have any any other requests that you want me to test on the Radiant R four, just let me know. Any other games or so, you know, just let me know. Or if you want me to try like a certain, like uh, well, pretty much I've tested all the settings for 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 this Red Dead Redemption PC port. I've tested all the settings. Well, not all the settings. I haven't tested like high and ultra and any of that because it wouldn't make sense, you know. So I just test like 720p, 1024 by 768, 800 by 600, and 640 by 480 on the first video so if you want to see all that resolution I tested if you want to see if you want to see all those resolutions I tested just go to the first video and you'll see it and yeah this is this is how reddit runs and I don't want to make this video too long so yeah this is how uh, the undead nightmares DLC runs and yeah Thank you guys for watching and see you in the next video. Bye. Oh, wow. Ooh.